Hi guys, how are you doing? Oggy Five Up, and this is my 100 subscriber video setup. Um, I said a bit. I sort of planned this from I think 50 subscribers onwards, and what I sort of did to try and you know help the channel grow and whatever else. I said, look, if, if I get 100 subscribers, um, I do like a little video setup and what I use or whatever else. So I mean, it's an absolute glorious day today. So I've had to sort of shut the curtains a little bit because even though it is England, it, it's it's it is about nine o'clock in the morning um, and it's absolutely red hot already so I've had to sort of draw the curtains closed but what I use is I sort of I, this is sort of the old front room um, and just to give you a little glimpse of my past a little bit because obviously nobody really knows who I am um, obviously I've got a few pictures on the wall obviously for the Sheffield United fan then fair enough um, a couple of my old army pictures um, which obviously there's me in the background which you just can't see which is good um, and then that's really it. I don't have any more pictures on there. It's just to sort of remind me what I've done and everything else. Um, my sort of beautiful gamer chair, which is a nice black leather with sort of red piping and whatever else. Uh, very comfortable. So I, I have upgraded quite a lot. Um, I used to use like little, the little, um, what are they? You know the little chairs that sort of sit on the floor? The, the, the little sort of X rockers, actually. I used to have a little X rocker. And so I sort of upgraded to like a proper PC chair. Um, oh, let's have a look. We've got my normal computer on it. It's just a standard Samsung, nothing special at all. It's not a bank or anything. It's just a normal monitor to sort of run the PC off. Uh, the PC itself, if you want specs for this, I can sort of give you it. Again, if you're in England, uh, there's a company called CCL, and they're very good at custom computers. Um, it's only an i5, because uh, I didn't really want to pay another 200 quid for the i7. But the graphics card, memory, and everything else is absolutely huge. It's got about five USB 3 uh, ports on it. A uh, little clock that I got off the boss the other day, which is quite nice. Um, these, the obviously the Xbox One, with the little sh shitty chat adapter next to it. Uh, obviously the old 360, with a little bit of a logical spray just for the screen, just to keep them nice and tidy. Uh, Xbox One controller. But the desk itself, it's actually, it is a custom build desk, believe it or not. Um, it's got a nice little feature behind the back where you can't see any wires, the little wires are sort of tucked behind where this little strip is in the middle there. It's on sort of magnet so I can tuck all the wires behind it, um, which is quite good. Again, a, a friend of the family sort of knocks it up for me. You know, he, he, he's a very good shot fitter. Um, big draw, bit of work stuff inside, whatever else. Obviously some of the things from the PC that I've got, some of the build. Uh, my old Tritons that I've still got that I for some reason can't even sell yet because um, nobody sort of wants to buy Tritons anymore. Uh, little game draw. Let's have a look. So for Xbox One, obviously Forza 5, Ghost, Titanfall, Battlefield. There is some work DVDs that I've got. And obviously all my old 361s. We obviously all the college. Obviously the first college we had. I did have just Modern Warfare. Uh, but that was the one that I sort of really got into college with uh, Modern Warfare 4. Uh, let's have a look. Even Gears War at the back. And obviously that your shape. That's not mine. That's the missus's your shape. Um, on top, we've got, uh, again, just a sort of standard power cord gamer mouse. Very cheap, again, from CCL. Very good. Little button on top there. It's sort of, you know, when it, when it comes to your mouse cursor speed and that, as you can see on the screen, it, it speeds up, slows it down. I don't know the proper wording for it because I'm, I'm not a proper PC gamer. Again, a nice sort of power cord um, cord, uh, keyboard, sorry. If you press a little light, you sort of blue lights, green lights off and on so in the dark you, you can sort of see all your keys if you're playing in the dark which is quite cool again only very cheap i think the mouse is about nine quid for like a basic pc gamer mouse um and the keyboard would probably about 13 14 quid very cheap um little toy fans cap obviously i am from yorkshire and the toy fans came from my village um about two weekends ago now which i watched saturday sunday and i was looking off to stand at the road arms fully spread coat or jacket open to try and catch any freebies so that was one of the little kingdom out my hats that sort of got thrown out. Uh, again, this is quite good for any guys that are looking at starting YouTube. Um, obviously, all you need is, but you don't need expensive stuff. Like you see some YouTubers have like eighty pound mouses. The chances are they probably never paid for them anyway. Um, so that's my Blue Yeti microphone. Again, you do if you're doing live comms and you do it through a gato, you can sit quite far back. But if you're doing it through Audacity, then you do have to sit quite close to it. And again, just on the uh, PC screen, I've actually got my Audacity settings just there. Um, I could do with tweaking them a little bit, but as it stands, you know, the, the, uh, they're not too bad. So when I'm sort of editing, obviously, the audio, I sort of minimise it so I can still look at this because I can't remember it off the top of my head so far. Um, basic little PC speakers. 
obviously the Xbox Connect, um, a little notebook and pen, obviously that's just to write some notes down, which to be honest when I do YouTube videos, I don't really write any notes down, I normally do it in one take, um, probably why, because they might suck so much, so I could probably do it doing a few couple of takes to be honest, but time is quite precious and I say I don't have that much time. A uh, few little, say little uh, mats for it, I normally put my beer to be honest, um, sometimes I might put a cup of coffee on it. Um, the Astro 40 mix amp, <clears throat> and then this is probably my pricing that I've got. It's the BenQ. I'll just sit back a little bit. It's the BenQ uh, XL 2720T. So it's not the 24 inch one, it's the 27. I, I couldn't imagine me playing on 24 inch. The, the 27 is perfect. Um, obviously, that's my last, my, my KD's drop loads. I, I started different player style, messing around. Got bored of ghosts a little bit, so I didn't really care. I'll, I'll try and load a little weird stuff out. So I've sort of tried to uh, play properly again, as you call it. As you see, my last five games, my, my, my KD started to creep back up again as I've started to settle down into my old play style again and and try and concentrate and get, get back into it. But yeah, this BenQ monitor, if you're looking at getting the monitors, uh, they're absolutely fantastic. Obviously, there's shitty Sky Bro, um, so BT Broadband, it's terrible. Uh, obviously, my Astro A40 is, it has a very nice little hook on the back. So obviously your very sexy Astros can sort of sit on a little hook at the back. Everything's sort of one finger lift with it. You sort of touch it at the bottom and you can tilt it back and forth. Um, the home monitor does actually pick up if I stop fudging about with it. Um, that's it, look. The home monitor comes up. You can bring it down. You, you can tilt it side to side. Very, very good monitor uh, for gaming on. Very, very good. I highly recommend it. You've got sort of custom buttons at the side where you can bring your little menu buttons up. You've got different screens there, one, two, and three, depending on what type of game you're playing. Absolute fantastic monitor. Um, I, I can't recommend it enough. So yeah, basically that's my setup. That's all I've got. Little monitor, quite a decent PC. Just sort of cheap sort of gamer stuff. Obviously there's my scuff controller. Again, I, I highly recommend these with the new Sidewinder paddles on. And I actually went for the... Uh, the sort of scuff pro grip this time, uh, the little rubber texture mines. But again, I've got two videos on the scuff. If you want to sort of find them on my channel and check them out, I've done some in-depth videos on them. Um, so that's it, guys. That's really it. This is sort of me sat here on a night time, a couple of friends, or normally just one friend, good old Gilly, is always there for me. Uh, normal monitor, again, you sort of, everything, I've, I've got everything there. Sony Vegas, Adobe Photoshop, uh, After Effects, uh, you know, the, the whole lot to sort of help me out and, and get me going. If you are new to YouTube and you, and you want to send me a message and asking me what stuff I use, like, you know, the, the power of the PC and um, what type of software I use for the uh, YouTubing activities, uh, please send me a message and I'll I'll try and get back to you straight away. But that monitor for me, the monitor and Astro A40s and the scuff controller is everything you need to try and become a, a, a better player. I'm not saying they do the work for you because you've still got to practice and, and get you, you have a certain skill level, but to help you out and fit, make you feel, I suppose it just makes you feel better. So if you feel better, then you technically play a little bit better because you have a bit more confidence. But anyway, guys, that's it. Um, again, just a little picture on the wall to see if you can spot who I am. Um, and again, thank you for 100 subscribers. Much I didn't even think I'd get this far anyway, to be honest. I thought I'd sort of get to 10 and 20, get body doing YouTube and sort of call it a day at that. Uh, but anyway, guys, so yeah, that's me. That's my beautiful desk. Oh, yeah, and with the uh, monitor, you actually get like a PVC cover to put on. So it always stays clean, never gets dusty. It's absolutely fantastic. So there you go, guys. My game is set up in hall and what I do and how I sit and chill and rage at people sat in corners still because that's how they play the game. And again, with the desk, if you live in England up north, and you fancy a custom desk like that, again, drop me a message and I'll send you the guys' details or did me it. But anyway, guys, thanks again, and as always, thank you very much for watching. Much appreciated. You never know, next time I might see 500 subscribers. But anyway, guys, cheers again. Thank you.